Howdy, ladies and gentlemen. Time for another uh, reaction, lesson, whatever video. Now, this one, someone uh, suggested during one of my recent live streams, but then it got taken down because it got blocked. So, I did listen to a few minutes of this, and it was bitchin'. Because it was so bitchin', it gets its own episode, right? So we're going to watch the whole thing through. Now, this is David Ryan Harris featuring... John Mayer and Friends, the YSD, Yesterday Shutting Down, Jam Session, Hotel Cafe 2420. Um, I actually got to meet David Ryan Harris uh, at NAMM this year, and I didn't know who he was. I, I, I met him uh, through Mike Bradley, who's another YouTuber, he's a friend of mine, and they knew each other. Um, and then as soon as someone at the live session threw this video up, I was like, I know that dude. And he's amazing. Amazing. So with that being said, we're going to jump right in here. We're going to jump right in. Um, I love Mayer. Uh, from what I remember, the band was killer. You got Isaiah Sharkey um, on the other guitar. Shall we? <laughs> So I love this groove, the bass and the drums already. It, the pocket is thick. So this is a one to a four so far in C sharp. So you got C sharp seven. To F sharp. Looks like he's in D. That's because he's probably tuned down, right? So uh, that's, what, uh, that's what that is. So it sounds like C sharp. If you watch him play it, it's looking like D because he's an E flat, you know? The Baltimore tuning, if you would. Oh! Oh my. Okay, we gotta go back. That was really annoying. Okay. That, that was some hot stuff right there. That, sorry, C sharp. A man after my own heart. All right, here we go. See that, 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 that mixing of that major and minor, switching to that major third there, and you see him come off that, right? Remember that, your six is your four, that lesson? Implying that four chord there by playing a third of it. Dude, it's tasteful, tasteful, you know. Here we go. That's my stuff right there. That, that, so we're in. So he switches to major here. Then he grabs, he grabs the major third and the minor third. Do a lap. God, he's good. 
Changes walking down to get the flat three dominant. Oh, no, that wasn't rehearsed. So I can put on my wings and I can get my long to release. Isaiah back there that just walking straight down chromatically. Now that 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 was a hot lick, ladies and gentlemen, back there by Mr. Sharky. Dude, okay, there's so many things to talk about in here. Um the band, the band is so good. Look, look at the horn player over there with the stink face. You know he's getting some, right? We're, we're, we're getting to you. You just, you're sitting down, you, you relax. You know, you relax. You, we know it's coming, right? The keys, the drums, and the two guitar players and the bass are so in sync. You have, you have Isaiah doing the low stuff, right? Um, you know, working with the bass player, you know, but like adding all the little chromatic stuff low. You got the keys doing that like kind of chord thing, like, you know, keeping the middle going. And you have John just doing straight texture on the back, just keeping the picking going, just that, that, uh... Right? It's all little, but if you listen to the whole thing together, you know, he's, John's kind of matching with the hi-hat, right? It's in that zone. And the whole thing, it, it creates this great mix when it's low. Harmonies are killer. I mean, it's just all so, it's just so killer. I can't believe I didn't know about this dude or this band. But then again, I don't live in LA anymore. Thank Jesus. Something like that. It's wild. See, Isaiah is getting all of the changes. He's getting all the thirds that come by. He's getting all of the chord functions in the low part of the guitar. You really, really hear it. Hard to do that when you have all this instrumentation on stage to find everybody's sound in the mix. Obviously, these guys play together a lot, right? Um, it, it's, and, and obviously he's just singing. He's not mudding it up by playing too. This is really masterful stuff.
They're the horns. They're the horns. All right. So we know it's coming. We know it's coming. You could watch this over and over again. Isaiah, and I, I can't see the bass player. I don't know who he is. Um, but the rhythm section, Isaiah is plugged in completely with the rhythm section. What's so wild is that you know Mare is going to get a turn, right? And you know he's getting a lot of clicks for this. A lot of you probably watched or clicking this because his name's in it. But he's in the back being a great band member, right? He is following, he's creating texture, and he's letting these guys, who obviously play together a lot, do what they do. It's so cool to see a rhythm guitar player like Isaiah getting the changes in the bass zone with the bass player and the keyboard player and having them all just sit in there. I mean, really good. I can't stress this enough. It's the last train. This evening, you can choose how you go home tonight. You Do you hear how no one is in anybody else's space? Harp, like in the mix, you know, high, mid, low, and rhythmically. Just the way the drums come in and the bass will add like bo bo bo, and then there'll be a little key splash after that, and then a little guitar thing, you know, that. Uh, Right? It's all, like, listen to it. Really listen to it. How much space is in there. But everybody's playing. You can go home completely spent. Leave all your shit here and go home joyful. That's on you all. Because I'm going to have a good time no matter what. I'm going to get pulled over. You're going to be like, you drunk? And I'm like, you obviously were not at a hotel cafe. I'm high on some other shit. Look at that simple. Want you to put your hands together. Come on, let's go on your feet. Put your hands together. Come on, let's go on your feet. Watch the drummer. You know he's looking at Isaiah, right? Watch the drummer. Watch how much he's waiting to release the backbeat of the snare. You know, it's it's things like this when you play in a band together. It's it's. You have to know, you have to, you have to intimately understand that it's different with everyone you play. Everybody's groove is a little different. So to lock in, you have to wait for the snare to release you, right? The push pushes it, right? The kick pushes it, the hi-hat and whatever, or the ride, that gives you your basic feel. But the groove isn't released until the snare allows you to do that, right? Watch the drummer. Put your hands together. Come on, it's on the feet. Wow, there's a good time waiting for you. So come on and let's get free. Put your hands together. See how much groove is in there? Y'all hear me? Put your hands together. Come on, it's on the feet. He's holding you all the way back and all the way forward. He's got you the whole way. And everybody else, from John to the keys, whatever, they're all just adding those little syncopations in the middle to keep that. I mean, it's it, it's not simple. Put your hands together. Come the hi hat drop. Feet. There's a good time waiting for you. It's at the end of Bob Riddle's horn. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on, Bob. 
is so killer. I love horn players, man. I, all of you, I, I, you, you know, horn players can only play one note at a time. I implore all of you to try to think like a vocalist or horn player when you're taking leads and think one note at a time, whether you're high or low. It's, it's such an amazing way to play. Um, I got to go back to the rhythm on this one, right? The band, you ever notice that when you're at a crowd, you're in an audience, the audience never claps in time, ever? I got news for you. It's not happening in here. Why is that? Why is that? Is this an amazing audience? Eh. You know, the numbers are against that being correct. What's really correct is that the drummer, the rhythm section, right? They all have the audience in the palm of their hand. They're all grooving so hard that the even the audience knows that they're waiting to be released with that backbeat and they do it together. It's amazing to see. It's amazing to hear because um, that never happens. Audiences never do that. And it's because your rhythm section isn't this good. <laughs> saw that last time. That hi-hat drop? Jesus. I'm telling you. I'm sorry to keep talking about the whatever, but no, I'm not sorry. You're really only ever as good as your drums and, and your rhythm section in general. It's rhythm first, everything else comes after that, because you have to build upon that. That is what, that is upon what you build. Whatever, I don't even say that. But watch this little hi-hat drop. <laughs> But the, but the, oh, it makes it. It that little hit is what keeps you in it. They know. All those mixing majors and minors right there, you know, he's all fingers, you know. Uh. And moving up, moving up into that minor shapes, your your minor pattern four. Jump it up into major. I love those that that He does it so slick that that five flat five four three 
that major again. happening in the rest of the band the whole rhythm section is on it it's look john is a great guitar player okay uh, you can't if you're watching this or any of his other stuff and you're hating on him you're you're just being a hater you're not being honest but listen to this band listen 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 to them start to all get the same thing That, that, uh. They're each doing a different variation of that, but you're getting the changes that. Ba -da 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 -da. I mean, that is improvised. It's freaking killer. It's the it's the uh, it's the triad. The the uh, uh, the dominant triad one three five root flat out there if you don't audiate try to audiate i am horrific at it but that's where you try to get the note you know ooh, ooh. you try to you try to audiate the pitch when you're playing it and when you improvise killer to see people do it live but try to do it it, it really gets your inner ear um tied with your fingers
how good that is? You know how, you know how damn good that is? To st Dude starts with audiation, right? One note at a time. Then adds the chords, singing the melody notes that he wants in the chords. Then adds the lyrics and then starts legit singing over top with runs, connecting all the chords, starting at a low, going to high, you know, like volume-wise, dynamics. Ten. Don't know that dude's name. This band is so bitchin'. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I can't, I, I would, it would be a dream come true to play with a band like this, even for one song. But if they ever come... You guys ever come to the East Coast? I don't know. Are you an L.A. thing? I don't know. Let's... I can't wait to meet you again, brother. I want to set this up just right. This is always one of my favorite parts of the evening when we were out. When uh, we just let Sharky loose. Let Sharky loose. So... I think it's just y'all two and Sharky. I want y'all to build something magical. Tone and a touch. Jesus, what phrasing, too. Holy crap. See that? You see? You see how connected this band is? That as soon as soon as he goes bump -a -bum, bump -a -bum, immediately replicated on the hi hat, and look how happy he is to do it. Shut your mouth. <laughs> that little tritone down. I love this stuff. to talk about in here I can't keep starting and stopping the video but like just just the, the sequenced runs the the mixing of major and Meyer the chromatic stuff the grabbing two notes and bending it up the 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 touch the dynamic change the the the, the keeping it sensitive at speed there's so much unison bit. Back in the 
Queen of God appear. Exactly how long Y'all feel good? time from the bottom of my heart for coming out. Take all these people up on this stage, Mr. Carlos Ricketts. Ms. Tiffany Palmer. Vicky Flores. John Clayton Mayer. Sean Hurley on the bass. What a band, what a band. Come on, what a one. I was driving home last night, and I was like, how can I explain this feeling to people? Getting to stand up here on this stage and do this thing that I do with these people up here that do it with me. And I was like, I'm just a quarterback. I can't block for myself. But I'm just calling the plays. There's no better feeling than knowing that your team you know you have is on point in every way. Ooh, don't forget the sharp balls down here on the truck. Yeah. Yeah. Now, we've been waiting for it. My name is David Ryan here. I mean, I mean, <clears throat> it, 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 th that, that is one of the best random videos I have ever seen of uh, a true band, a true band that is doing it right together. Um, there's so much to talk about, but I'm just, I'm just going to, I'm just going <sighs> to, It's so hard to find a good drummer, right? One that keeps everybody at the same time. Forget about like your actual timing. I'm talking about where is the one? Where is the pocket? Where is the groove? Knows when to release the groove with the back feet, okay? Then having a bass player and rhythm guitar and keys and two other guitars to have everybody know where they are, not just harmonically, but sonically in the mix and rhythmically how to accentuate what the drummer is giving them. Horn parts that match. Vocal harmonies tasteful that come in and come out at the perfect time. Incredible soloing, right? Incredible individual I mean, every part of it. He is a phenomenal singer and frontman. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this is this is one of the best bands in the game. I have not seen them before. I want to. Dude, David, I can't believe I met you at NAMM and didn't know who you were. I know who you are now.
I hope you come to Baltimore. Or maybe if I go to NAMM next year, maybe you're playing a show, you know I'll be at that one. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching these. I sincerely appreciate it. Um, love it. Love, I mean, look how happy everyone is. That's how you know you're doing it right. That's what he's talking about when you're in the car on the way home. Maybe you were in a hotel cafe last night because you don't have that glaze over your face. Look how happy John Mayer is. Look at all of them. Look at all of them. And it's such a band performance. It's not... It's not the John show. Doesn't need to be. He's a great band member in this video, in this band. It, I love it. These are pros. Pro pros. Pro 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 pros. Pros. You hearing me? All right, enough rambling. Love you guys. Uh, thank you so much for liking, subscribing, ringing the bell, supporting this channel uh, by um, subscribing over at my website, guitargate.com, first link in the description. And don't forget, leave links to live tracks in the comments. We do it live. We do it together. I love you guys. I'll see you real soon. Cheers. Mm. Mm. About as good as I've ever seen.